What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. In this one, I'm going to be giving you some inspiration for your Facebook ads in 2020. We're going to go into four different industries and kind of analyze the different ads and hopefully give you some awesome inspiration so that you can apply them to your business. Before we jump into that, something that you really, 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 really need to understand before you start marketing on Facebook or Instagram or any other social media platform is this marketing funnel that's right here on the, the screen right now. So it doesn't matter if you can go into the back end of Facebook and run an ad or boost a post if you don't understand this funnel. And the reason is that you're trying to get people to be aware of your business, to engage with your brand before you ask them to even consider doing business with you. And you have to ask them to consider before you ask them to buy. So something, this comes from a book called Story Brand, really, really good book. I'll link down to it in the description below. But um, Donald Miller in this book, what he talks about is a lot of times what we ask for is for somebody to marry us straight out of the gates. We say, hey, will you marry me? And they say no. And then we say, okay, well, will you go on a date with me? And then they say yes. And then we say, will you marry me? And they say no. And we say, will you go on another date with me? And they say yes. And then eventually we take them out on enough dates to the point where they are willing to marry us or buy our products. And that's really what this marketing funnel represents in a sense is that they have to become aware of us. And just like the decision to marry somebody, buying your product becomes a big decision and you have to make sure that you walk them through that process. So we're gonna analyze these ads and see how they go through this marketing funnel. And just make sure that you understand this before you run. I've, I've got a lot of other videos on my channel about it, but just make sure you understand it before you run ads, please, 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 because otherwise they're not going to work. All right, so this first one is the Life Coach School, a lady named uh, Brooke Castillo, I think. And what they do is they sell info products or like online coaching to people who want to change their lives. And then they also sh sell Life Coach certification to other people who want to help other people change their lives. So if we come down here, let's look at this example. Uh, she says, there was a time in my life when I wasn't happy. I was overweight and I drank too much and I worried all the time. I worried about losing weight. What if this exercise plan doesn't work? What if it's too hard? I worried about drinking. What will people think if I'm not drinking? How will I have fun? Mostly I worried about my future. What if I can't achieve my goals? That's when I realized that the act of worrying was actually preventing me from taking positive action. I was stuck in the very place I was worried about, staying overweight, drinking too much, and being unhappy. So you can pause the video and, and read the rest of that. But basically what she's doing here is calling out, it's, it's like she's ripped a page out of somebody's diary here. And when this shows up on their Facebook feed, they're like, wow, that sounds exactly like me. Like I'm overweight and I drink too much. And they're, they're gonna click read more on that ad, they're gonna read through, and then they're gonna click through on this ad, and it's gonna take them to this landing page. So as you can see, this landing page is super simple. It loads really fast. So they'll come in here, learn how to stop worrying today. One, worry pretends to be necessary. Worry is an excuse not to act. Three, stop worrying in four simple steps. So then if I click here and submit my information, we'll go to a video webinar. I'm not sure how long it would be. But uh, that's a really awesome ad, again, because it's calling out the specific pains and it's acting like, like she's talking about exactly the problem that these other people have had. So that's a great example from the Life Coach School. And that's kind of the online courses, info product space. That's one industry. So the second industry I want to talk about is the software industry. And that's, we're going to talk about Russell Brunson. He owns a company named ClickFunnels, really awesome company. They, they have an online software program that allows you to build really cool funnels so that you can send your traffic down them or your customers down them. Uh, let's look at one of his ads. So what's interesting about Russell is that he has a lot of different products. Um, but let's, let's look at this top one here. So he says, I'm giving away the exact same script I use for all my webinars for free. Don't try to reinvent the wheel. Follow my proven webinar process and watch your sales. So he's definitely using the marketing funnel here. So if this showed up on your feed and you were like, yes, I want that for free. I don't, maybe you know what a webinar is. Maybe you don't, but you're kind of interested in that whole space. Then you definitely click on this. It'll take you to a landing page. This is built with ClickFunnels. You can, this is like the kind of stuff that you can build with the software that he offers. Then he's got this video, and then you fill out your information, and he'll charge you, probably charge like 10 bucks for shipping or something like that. And so he gets your information, and then after that, he's going to upsell you on other products. That's 
uh, totally his style. So that's a great inspiration, giving away something for free and really, really leveraging the funnel that somebody's becoming aware of him and then they're considering him and they also become very, very indoctrinated because they're already, they've already bought something from him. Depending how long this training program is, at the end of it, the person's going to be totally indoctrinated and he does the same thing with book funnels. So like this one, he's selling expert secrets. This book is going to show you how to sell your expert advice, build a mass movement and turn your calling into income. Your message matters. And then you click here to learn more. It takes you to expertsecrets.com, fill out your information. And because you've read the book, then you're totally committed to Russell. You're committed to his software. And he ends up selling you down the line on that. And, and the other thing about Russell is that he runs a ton of ads. They've, they run so much paid traffic. So if you come through here, um, by the way, the tool that I'm using to look at these ads is facebook.com forward slash ads forward slash library. I can also link to that down in the description. Next industry that I wanted to talk about is local business. I worked with a lot of local businesses and it's a little bit of a different game because you don't have as much money as these guys to send out all sorts of free stuff and you're not selling stuff online and you're not usually dealing with something that's as internal as what Brooke Castillo is talking about in here. It's usually an external pain. I know the agency that runs the ads for this company. They do a really, really good job. So let's see what, let's analyze what they're doing here. They say, hey, Valdosta and surrounding area. This is like a physical therapist, by the way. My name is Dr. Mormon and I help relieve knee pain symptoms like swelling, stiffness, redness, and warmth, weakness, instability, crunching noises, and much more. So right there, he calls out all of the possible problems that somebody could have. So if that shows up on your Facebook feed, you're like, yeah, I have crunching noises in my knees. What the heck? How does this guy know what I need? Uh, we're giving away 27 vouchers this month to promote our office for free knee pain consultation. With all the complications involved in invasive surgeries, infections, anyone, it's no wonder that hundreds of people have come to me to discover our all-new natural and non-invasive treatment option. So usually if you're, if you're a local business, you can come up with some sort of deal to offer on your Facebook ads. And this is what they've done. I don't know if they already do for your consultations. I would assume they do, but they're making it sound like they don't. And they're offering this 27 vouchers to people to come in that month. So then they click here, come to a landing page, and they take a little quiz. That's cool. So uh, knee pain, just go through this. And then you'd enter your email and they'd call you. This, that's what the, they do. This office would call you and invite you in. So they have a lot of other ads running as well. The pictures are great. This is like totally shows the local flavor of this office. And if somebody's dealing with these things, this kind of ad is totally going to speak to them. So it's kind of the opposite of Brooke Castillo. She's talking about internal problems and this care medical center is talking about external problems. So now let's talk about e-commerce. Dollar Shave Club is the one I chose for this. So any sort of online store or e-commerce company might follow these tips. So what they're doing here, like this, like smooth shaves are in your future right now, get our six blade razor for just $5. So they made it really simple. And then they've also got this really interesting ad. Like if you saw that on your profile. Let's the more see. blades, the better. If it has to work on a man's face, it can totally handle my leg. So there's a concept here called pattern interrupt, which is when somebody's scrolling through their Facebook feed and they see an ad like this, they're totally going to stop and watch it because it's so unusual. So that's what they're using here. This is a different kind of ad. They're kind of going through all of the other products that they talk about there. And then like, look at this, like this is just really taboo and they're putting it right in your Facebook feed. So people are going to pay attention to that. It might scare off other people, but there's a lot of other people that'll look at it and engage with the ad. So let's click through and see what kind of landing page they have. This is pretty typical for an e-commerce company. So it looks like this is the only place you can go, but then if you scroll down to the bottom, you can click through to their main website and kind of see everything. But they're trying to get you to buy something for just $5 and then down the line, they'll sell you on a recurring revenue thing or they'll I get more money out of you somehow. So name, like they're just making this super, super simple for you, which is cool. And the website looks beautiful as well. You have it. There are a few ads to inspire you and your Facebook ads for the new year. Make sure to ask me any questions in the comments that you have. I'd be interested to know where you look for inspiration for your Facebook ads or your online ads. If you like the video, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel. We release new content like this every single week. If you're interested in more things that have to do with Facebook ads, 
you can look at these other videos on my channel that talk about them. I love Facebook ads. I've spent a lot of time running them, managing a team that runs them, and we've, we've managed a lot of ads, been for a lot of clients all over the country. So feel free to ask me any questions and reach out to me at any time. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you soon.